Right then guys, got some more Star Wars news for you today. This comes courtesy of makingstarwars.net, so please do head on over there via the link in the description box if you want to check out some more stuff. But apparently, according to them, they have it on good authority that the live-action Star Wars TV series from John Favreau is going to be filming next week. That's when it's going to start. This is the first foray into live-action stuff for Star Wars and will be on Disney's direct-to-consumer streaming service. There are some photos, which you'll see on the screen now. Obviously, makingstarwars.net have said we're not going to you know, disclose the locations out of respect for the production, which makes sense. But apparently, in addition to this particular location in the photos, they have also learned that there will be some filming in a coastal area as well. So there's potential for you know, water and beaches coming into play. Apparently, again, this is all according to makingstarwars.net, the live action show is rumoured to be about the Mandalorians after the fall of the Empire. This is going to be set seven years after Return of the Jedi and there's going to be some very familiar locations, uh, Mandalore, Tatooine. These photos themselves look like they're set on Tatooine. I mean, it's a very, very familiar aesthetic to anyone that's seen any Star Wars films. It's sand, it's yeah, it's, it's got to be Tatooine. I'd be very surprised if it, you know, if it isn't. So I thought I'd bring you this news and just ask you guys, are you excited for this? Because of course, this is only going to be available as far as we're aware on Disney's streaming service, which a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of these companies are now producing their own streaming services rather than kind of farming them out to Netflix. So is this a streaming service that you are going to be getting? Are you excited to be returning to Tatooine? And of course, the fact that this is after Return of the Jedi and kind of filling in some gaps potentially in the Star Wars franchise. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. As well, is this one of those things where you think it's going to be potentially a saving grace for the Star Wars franchise? Because of course Kathleen Kennedy has ruined it for a lot of people. So for those people that are of that opinion, do you think that this, you know, from John Favreau, who's highly regarded, do you think this will be a saving grace? Let me know down below in the comment section. Good, bad, I want to hear it all. Guys, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Stay up to date on all the world of pop culture and movie news. As always, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like and a share. That really helps me out. I'm MSH. I will catch you in the next video.